Oh my gosh. If you could just please cut this <laughs> for me, because, um, you know, the beauty industry oh, what? pays off. Okay, wait, did you record that? No. Oh. I love teaching. It's my favorite thing to do in the whole world. Um, I have a passion for it, like no one's business. <laughs> one in a million. 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 Um, it is 10 in the morning and right now I am on my way into my cousin's salon. She asked me to be a makeup model today, so I don't have anything on right now. And we are in Six Corners by Fancy Costumes. And it is so cute over here. But anyways, okay, so we're walking into her salon. And I'm excited to see what they're gonna do. Okay, that's not it. <laughs> um, we're here at Portage Theater. And she's literally right next to it, so. Hopefully they do something bomb. I put nothing past her, okay. So we are here! <laughs> Your camera's beautiful. Okay, if you guys need anything like permanent makeup, lash extensions, brow shaping, come here. Okay, guys, so we are about to start this makeup class. Okay, so we have some makeup palettes. I don't know who this is from. That's Jacqueline Hill. Jacqueline Hill. And some more stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and her great yeah. brushes. Okay, you should do a before and after though. Okay. Like, this is the before. Well, not me. Ew. <laughs> this is my face before. Yes. Twenty-five. Oh really? Were you, so twenty-five over? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anything on your skin? Just um, my skin routine. Okay. I'm gonna need you to open those up before you lose. What? Those are your I need you. <laughs> like I'm just like. Yes, I moisturized. I can put my shoes because I'm so worried about it. I just want to see like makeup. What time did you guys eat the class? That's on Sunday or Saturday? I believe it's Sunday. Oh yeah, I can come on Sunday. Cool. We got all that going on. Um, and then to prep the skin, um, what would you use? Primers or moisturizers or anything like that. If not, I can have you use mine, but I just want to see. Okay. Let's start getting their faces primed. Um, with these chairs, I'm gonna like get them comfortable and I'm gonna lean them back. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> that comfortable. I'm sure. People tell me that all the time. There? Yeah. Or now? No, that's good. Right there. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and sanitize my hands. So I'm gonna mist her with some rose water. I'll have you use mine as well. Thing. 
I look like I got punched in my eye. <laughs> oh. Guys, so I'm done. I didn't get to film the whole thing. It was kind of a lot, so I didn't want to like be in the way. I just kind of wanted her to do her thing. And this is kind of a lot more makeup than I would put on myself. Again, like I don't really do, I don't really do eyeshadow and stuff, but yeah, this looks really good. She did a great job. Um, we didn't do any lashes or liner because she had another model and the girl who she was teaching came an hour late. I mean, who can complain? I'm like all ready for the day. I'm home from getting my makeup done. I did a quick little run to Target because unfortunately I've been a little bit unorganized. I am a whore. Dur, hoarder. So my bathroom has given me a little bit of anxiety. So you guys are gonna come with me. I'm gonna do a little Target haul. So come with me. Literally, come with me. Okay, so if you guys are wondering what that sound is, it's my projector. And it's literally so loud. I actually just got started. I've been wanting one of these for a really long time. I know it might not seem important to like wash our brushes, but that's how you get acne and things just start to build up. So you always wanna make sure that you're keeping your brushes clean. Once or twice a month is fine because you don't wanna outdo and dry out the brushes. I got the makeup brush cleansing pad and I just checked it out. You just put it in the sink and it has suction cups. I'm using this beauty blender cleanser and it's four brushes as well. Just put a little bit on there, put a little water and clean your brushes and look at how clean my brushes are already. Look at how dirty this is. And then just run some water over it. Look at how clean it is. I will be using this. Okay, so these are disgusting. I don't know if you can tell. The Fenty brush, I hated it. Sorry, Rihanna. Um, it's a foundation, the 115 foundation brush. It's going in the garbage. Got this little thing that I'm so excited to use and spin it. That's cute. I got a new brush because my brush, I usually use a lot of hair products and look at my brush y'all like what that's all built up product it's just a no replace your brushes guys I'll put that in there I bought another brush um because all of my stuff pretty much went to work so this is for slicking my hair we're gonna open it and see how it feels little brush and I just use it to like when I put my product in and just smooth the hair so it's nice and firm nice so I'll put that in there I bought a new tanning mitt again because this mitt has been through it it is worn the hell out my fingers are like peeking through so it was time for a new mitt but I don't know if I'm gonna put oh this is I don't know if this is too cheap why do they make these so cheap that so that you can keep buying them if you guys like can see how thin this is You can see my finger through it. I bought a gua sha, needed. That's the only thing actually that I didn't have. Um, I have all kinds of stuff. Mm. Also got hair scrunchies. You know how you lose them? If you're a girl, you just know. So all of mine are gone. This little brush from e.l.f. That's what it looks like. And I will definitely let you guys know how it works. I got another e.l.f. brush. No, I'm lying. I got a uh, brow lift applicator. So I've been needing this for show. 
because I've been doing less makeup and less makeup. That's why I can't wait to take this off because I don't know. I'm just not into like so much makeup anymore. It just doesn't, I, I've never really liked the way makeup feels. So this comes with a fresh new spoolie, which I needed. Um, and then it comes with the brow lift applicator. This is also by e.l.f. This was $5. I bought a callus shaver. I don't know how to use this. This is for your corns and just to like smooth out the, the balms of your feet. The palms, I don't know. Look at how nice this is. Plastic thing. I'm gonna keep this plastic bag because I don't really know how to use this thing and I'm scared. I bought um, the e.l.f. soap brow infused with shea butter, it's clear. Um, so this is to get that feathered look on your brows. And I'm really, really excited to use this. So this is what it looks like. I'm gonna smell it. Cute, okay. Oh. Okay, the whole thing just comes out. Um, yeah. We're gonna keep you in there, buddy. Um, I also got a new nail polish, which I'm excited to use. I feel like it'll look cute on me. Also this, um, comment down below. Let me know if you guys have ever used this. Um, it's that dip it thing, which I've used, but built-in scrubber brush removes glitter and gel polish from natural nails, removes artificial nails. Okay, so I have Gel X on my nails right now, so I am, I am excited to use this. So we'll see if this works. And Adrian is a big slipper person, and he always tells me that I need to put on house shoes. Um, they've never been my thing. Maybe that's why I have calluses on my feet. I'm just kidding, I don't have calluses. But I got these cute little knockoff Drew slippers. That's everything that I got from Target, guys. Um, low key, I wanna take my makeup off.